affected by Creutzfeldt Jakob disease gathered at Lake Bing for the Strides for CJD event. Our own eyewitness reporter Tim Johns is here live to tell us why the event has such a special meaning for people here in Bakersfield. Tim? Rena, you know, while the event was held in support of all people who suffer from CJD, many here in Kern County might remember that the disease affected a Bakersfield icon, former Mayor Harvey Hall. On Sunday morning, it was Bakersfield's turn to participate in Strides for CJD, a nationwide event that looks to raise awareness for people suffering from creutzfeldt jakob disease, a disease that causes proteins in the brain to misfold, leading to rapid mental and physical deterioration. Here in Kern County, many people came out in remembrance of former Bakersfield Mayor Harvey Hall, who died from the disease earlier this year. So it's very emotional for me, um, just um, knowing that everybody is here for him and, and for me, and uh, they've come out on a Sunday, and they've worked so hard to put this together. And beyond honoring those touched by the disease, Hall says today's event is important because it helps to shine a spotlight on a disease that not many people know about. We're, you know, educating people. So many people say I've never heard of this disease and um, now they do and um, we can maybe help someone else. Due to the disease's relative anonymity, Hall says there's not as much money dedicated to fighting it as other ailments. This disease is so rare, it does not get funding. Um, there, are no, uh, there aren't uh, trials, there's no drugs that are being tested. There's, there's research being done, but it, they struggle for money. But Kern County has heard the call. And of all the 16 cities nationwide that held stride for CJD events, Bakersfield was the one that raised the most money. And for that, Hall says she'll be forever grateful. So many people donated, so many businesses, so many people just opened up their, their hearts and their checkbooks, and I'm so appreciative. And all of the money raised will go to the CJD Foundation's general fund, which helps with medical education, family support, and research programs for those affected by the disease. Reporting live in studio, Tim Johns, Eyewitness News. Our Tim, thanks for that story. Well, coming up for you at 5 o'clock.